So in this video, I'm going to be showing you an updated method on how you can get the white helmet in GTA 5 Online after a patch of 1.67. So this is after the new Low Santos Mercenary DLC or a San Andreas Mercenary DLC. So the patch of 1.67. So uh, yeah, I'll be showing you a really easy method how you can get it. But before we do get into the video, if you don't want to join our shark card giveaway, all you have to do is subscribe to my YouTube channel, like this video, and then comment the word giveaway, and then you'll be entered straight in. The giveaway winner will be... Do I suggest you load into a public session for this? Go to online, go to play jobs, go to bookmark, and you're going to have to start this mission called Power Play 4. Now I will leave a link in the description down below for this mission right here so you will be able to bookmark it but make sure you do watch the video before bookmarking it. Now once you did bookmark the job and you did start it up, you will have to invite some players. And now this is why I said to join a public session. Usually people join this mission right here. As you can see, I invited my session and um, a lot of people actually did end up joining. So that's why I highly recommend you do join a public session. That way you won't need a friend to actually do this with. Now once you do start it up, the orange team is going to get the orange joggers with the orange helmet. And the purple team is going to get the purple joggers with the purple helmet. Now, if you do want to get the purple joggers, you have to be the second person to join. So somewhere else, we'll have to host it for you. Or if you're lucky, you might also end up on the purple team. So you don't, even if you do host it, you might end up on the purple team. Now, once you do load in, what you will have to do is basically, uh, you will see that you have the color joggers with the color bulletproof helmets. Now, open the interaction menu, go to styles and equip any gloves. Now, once you have equipped the gloves, back out of the mission through your using your phone. Now once you load back into online, you have to make your way to any clothing store and just save the outfit and boom, just like that, you got the orange joggers and the orange an orange helmet or uh, purple joggers and purple helmet. Now once you got your color helmet, so this is the first part of the method, what you will have to do is basically just uh, save this outfit right here and if you want to join this video, make sure you drop a like on it and subscribe if you haven't done so already. But what you're going to have to do is basically save this uh, orange or purple joggers, whatever one you got. And I will show you how you can actually uh, flip this to the white helmet. Now the first thing which you're going to have to do for this glitch right here, you're going to have to make your way to any clothing store. Now once you did make your way to a clothing store, you're going to have to go right here to clothing and uh, accessories. Now once you made your way to accessories, basically all you're going to have to do is so make sure you watch closely right here. You're going to have to make your way to biker helmets. So it's going to be this one right here. And now depending on what colored helmets you want, is going to be the one you're going to equip. Um, I will uh, leave like a list in the description down below of which which biker helmet equals what color bulletproof helmet. So just go to the description down below right now and check whatever one you want. And then that's the one you're going to have to equip. Now just save it in any slot. After you did do that, what you're going to have to do is equip an outfit with a bulletproof helmet. And um, just like that. And if you don't have an outfit with a bulletproof helmet, I will make a video um pretty soon on how you can get a colored bulletproof helmet so if you don't have one already for this glitch right here just make sure to click that subscribe button that way you don't miss when i upload um that video but if you do have a bulletproof helmet just save this into another slot uh, preferably to the slot right next to the one we just saved um i wasn't doing this on my account so i didn't have another slot so uh, i just saved it in this slot right here but it doesn't really matter just make sure you save it right next to each other after you've done that Basically, what you're going to have to do is, so you save it in a slot and call it C2. Now, after you do that, you're going to have to equip the outfit, the first outfit we made, called C1. And with the biker helmet, you're going to have to equip some glasses. Now, after you did equip the glasses, you should see like a yellow circle at the bottom right, saying the game has saved. Now, after you've done so, you're going to have to walk out of the clothing store. And basically, now, all you're going to need for this part right here is you're going to need a program called NetCut. And you can download it on Android and Mac. I will leave a link in the description down below for it. I want you made your way to NetCut, basically, and don't worry, it's not a virus. You're gonna have to go to find your IP console. You're gonna have to click on the blue Wi Fi um, symbol and then click on that, and it should turn red. Now your console should lag a little bit. You also will need a second console for this or a friend to help you out. And um, yeah, so basically, you're gonna have to tell your friend to log onto your account or you to go on your second console. 
So now once you did make your way on your second console, so as you can see C2. And once you did load in, I don't know what happened in chop there. But basically you're gonna have to open your interaction menu, go to styles, and then switch to C2. After you did do that, you're gonna have to go to accessories and just equip uh, some glasses and then wait for a yellow circle at the bottom. Now just tell your friend to back out into story mode or well, your other console. And basically if you're wondering what netcode is for, is basically so we can log in to another console on your account without getting kicked. Now back on console 1, you're gonna have to go to styles, accessories, and re-equip glasses. And you should get a yellow circle at the bottom that will not go away until you reconnect netcode. So basically go back to netcode, click on the red Wi-Fi symbol, and it should turn back to blue. And um, if you are on PlayStation, it will kick you out, but if you are playing on Xbox, uh, you will need to force this alert so go on your other console tell your friend to log back onto online or gta and then it should kick you out but on playstation uh, we get that alert automatically so you just wait a little bit and then you should get that alert but if you're enjoying this video make sure to drop a like on it and yeah, if you haven't already let's try to get to about um 200 likes i guess that'll be the goal for this video i'd really appreciate it if we could hit that and i actually getting pretty close to 72,000 subscribers so make sure i click that subscribe button because i am trying to reach like i said yeah 72,000 subscribers so i'd appreciate it if we could hit it um let's put a goal like before the end of the month or before the end of the week i don't really know I mean, depending when you're watching this but we're gonna just load back and it should load you into store mode <clears throat> after you did accept the alert now all you're gonna have to do is just start up an invite only session and now once you do load into online you should appear or you should spawn with a bulletproof helmet of your choice the one uh the biker helmet you equipped which will equal what bulletproof helmet so as you can see i spawned right here and i got the white bulletproof helmet and yeah there's a pretty cool glitch and how you can get all the bulletproof helmets obviously you need a bulletproof helmet already for this or a colored one um, but like I said, I will be making a video on this pretty soon, so make sure to click that subscribe button. But um, yeah, I'll catch you on my next video. Peace.